Hey guys, I got a quick little tutorial here for you on programming drums in Tux Guitar. I believe this also works in Guitar Pro, but don't take my word for it. I don't actually use that software. As a matter of fact, I don't even use this software. So, um, But anyway, I've seen a lot of tutorials and a lot of little about and how to's on this program saying that you have to memorize all these numbers. 35 for kick drum, 47 for tom. It's a lot easier than that, and I'll show you how. We're going to go in here, and we're going to add a new track. I got a quick little arrangement here, one of my own songs. We're going to double-click on the track here, and we're going to change it to a percussion track. Call it Drums, and OK. All right, now like I said, they're telling you that you have to go 35 for kick, you know, 47 for toms. I don't remember all these numbers because, frankly, you don't need them. What we're going to go to is view here, and we're going to show piano, all right? And here's the trick. Every single note on the piano stands for a MIDI on-off note. Now, in all the other instruments, you know, piano, guitar, bass, whatever, C is C, D is D, E is E, whatever. In drums, however, C is kick drum, D is snare drum, this is electric snare, and then we got tom, hi-hat, closed, or I believe that's foot, tom, hi-hat, just struck normal, tom, hi-hat, open, upper tom, upper tom, crash, so on and so forth. So basically, all of the stuff that I just did it's, it's fairly simple. All you got to remember is that these notes are all a different thing. So instead of remembering these numbers, just go kick drum here, kick drum here, <laughs> kick drum. Oops, sorry, I'm on the wrong C. Okay, we'll go with this one. Kick drum, 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 kick drum. All right, and then we come back through and we can go snare drum every other hit here. Okay, and then what we're going to do is I'm going to put a crash in. I'm going to use this crash here. And I'm going to do one of those little dance beats. So open hi-hat and then uh, hi-hat foot to close the hi-hat. Okay, and then we have, I'm going to just take this measure. I'm going to measure. Yeah, let's see here. Copy measure, and we're going to copy from 2 to 3, and we're going to unselect all tracks to copy that measure over there. Oh, oops. See, I don't know, I don't know how to use this. Copy measure from 2 to 2, just the drum tracks, and we're going to go over to this, and we're going to paste it. Where is it? Measure, paste measure, paste at current measure. Paste count. Well, let's let's give this a shot. Three. There we go. It just loops it through there. Now we'll play this and we'll see what we got. All right. Well, I don't really. I'm not really fond of the kick snare thing. I'm gonna do every other for the snare. I'm gonna go snare right here. Instead, I'm gonna get rid of all those snares. And you see, all I'm doing is using the arrow arrow keys to go over, and I'm just finding the spot where I want it, and I'm just adding it there. It's that simple, guys. It's that simple. So once again, we're gonna go measure, copy measure, from two to two, just the drums. We're gonna take. Select that measure, we're going to paste measure, and we're going to paste count three, that gets it all the way through to the loop here. Should be, maybe, maybe. Let's see, paste, current measure, paste count three. There we go, there it is. All right, now let's play. <laughs> So you see, it's really that simple. All you gotta do is remember that the kick drum starts on C, and then just just play with these. All you have to do is select the area in the measure, hit one of the notes. Oh, 
that's a hi-hat. Didn't want that. Select it, delete. Oh, that's Tom, didn't want that. You just play with it. Starting with C, kick drum, snare drum, snare drum, toms. You know, all the drums tend to be on the, uh, on the white notes and all the cymbals tend to be on the black notes. Um, there are a couple cymbals on black notes and vice versa, but uh, you get the point. It's a lot easier if you do it this way. So uh, have fun and enjoy.